Hello, welcome to a new episode of Young Suns TV in association with CMG Systems. Today, the Suns face Preakin at CMG Systems Stadium. One of Suns. Right, guys, I'm here with Kyle Hutton and Stuart Carswell. Thank you guys for taking your time uh, for a couple of questions and an interview. So, let's get it. So, what is the best thing about playing in a couple of months? Uh, right now, different chances every week for us. <laughs> That's the thing. Uh, no, I've had highs for the last season, obviously the cup final and stuff like that. Uh, then we get relegated, and then this season we thought we get a chance to uh, week one and go back up, and it's not been the case. We've, uh, we've struggled a bit at the start of the season, things have changed, but for us now it's just about getting, uh, getting ourselves safe and going to get next season, hopefully. Ah, just the same. Obviously, we thought, I think we're making do. I thought we'd ease up where it was. Um, that sort of took it by surprise, but we've got the chance now. I've also had a good run there, and then we've had a couple of bad results, so we've got a chance now just to sort of a few more results, get ourselves safe, and then just go to the next year. Who has the worst DSMs in the team? Well, worst of this is, that's a good one. Gal. Gallagher. No, because he comes in for work, there's a good clothes on sometimes. No, I'm going to be, I'm going to be, I've got to see Mango. Mango's got high top shoes, I think they're going to be Maddie Sarashi on the top. Honestly, they're coming a bit here. They're coming a bit here. He talks to jeans in the back of them, so they're big tongue sticks up. No, he says they're limited edition. That's what he says, but they're all limited edition because they're just buy them. But I'll say that Beanie's just over the top, but if you go for a coffee with Beanie, just like, you'll be there. That's a three-piece suit. 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 I don't know. I'll keep to mango. 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 Who's the funniest? Funniest? Oh, so Who gives a good? That's right. Wee Dom. Dom's quite funny. Dog, he gives it out. It's it, far too much for Andy Dowie. Andy Dowie to leave cause him. That's why I'm talking about. That's why Dowie's a left. Dom is the year that's taken. Uh, mango, you have a good laugh, and he takes it with mango, big mango. Mango, he seems to be an everything. Who else? Grant Adam, actually, when he turns up, he's a good laugh. You just bombard him. Honestly, the guy is unbelievable. Beanie? He just, he just takes a laugh after anybody he can get, honestly. Aye. He comes out of the chairman sometimes. Aye, he comes out of the train and blow it. He just jumps in, he jumps in everybody's car, I think. He just stands at the side of the road and he's done it. Aye. He's going for a laugh, mate. We'll go, we'll go with Dom, but he's got him. I think, okay, we'll go with Dom. What was your thoughts on just the next game? Um, we won the up, as I said, it was a scrappy game, so I thought we made us a Nick Devan Mill, and that just changed dramatically, got in 2 1 at half time. But as it is, sort of the positives we take from it is when the goal goes down, they sort of get together and they don't really give up, do you know what I mean? Which is a good, good thing to have, so a bit of a wild game, but in the end, I think it was a good point. It was better, it was better solid. I was, I was in the solid the game, I was never to watch it, it was why it was just a scrappy game. Then. Just as the same, but it's just goals. I mean, that's what the fans want to see. The fans want to see goals. Nobody can take the fans. They'll do a good side. Aye. As well, so I think it's a good point. They're a good side. Got to get away from them, but it was rather of a, a threat instead of a one-inch or a nut-inch. You know what I mean? It's better for the fans. Uh, what's your opinion on the uh, opposition that they're breaking? Well, they've signed you in January, I think. They've uh, added good, good faces, old experienced faces. Uh, we had to beat, we played them a few times last season, the last game we played them, was a, they nicked it one of them, was it? Mm -hmm. We played them and I scored them the last minute. The game here, we beat them, I think it was 4-0, that was even before we went to Dublin actually, so it was because we were on the same flight as us, that was a good laugh. The airport's in Calcutta, so big big hill, what a man, so he was after the game. Uh, no, it was a tough game, but we had to win the day, so today, so I think it'll be a competitive game. No, it'll be a good game, it'll be a good game. As I said, we've played them enough times, obviously, we were in the championship as well last year. So we seem to so beat more than beat in the last minute. We always seem to do well against them, so hopefully touch with it. We can do um, well again today and get three points. Last question, uh, what's your opinion on the office? It's good. I was just started, didn't I? So it's, it's good for us. It's, they create an atmosphere at the stadium and places like this you go to hey, this level, you don't really have that sometimes. Like, uh, you definitely hear them, you're out there. It's, I think it's good as well. So you see young kids are doing it. You can only encourage other people to come along. And, it's players that actually want more people to come see you. Uh, they've got the atmosphere and they've got the atmosphere with players. Definitely. Uh, you hear them before the game, so singing and stuff like that. And as Carly says, it's, it's your home patch, so you want that atmosphere going, do you know what I mean? So, um, definitely, it's good. And, you know, it's, uh, they're youngsters and we'll start getting them into the game, hopefully, as well. Cheers, guys. No worries, thank you. That was good. <laughs>
Questioned the, the attitude of the players and the, the desire of the players. We've made basic errors at times and ultimately that, that costs you goals or costs you games, but it's not for you know, lack of effort or these type of things. So I think the, the, the attitude of the players has, has been terrific over the last few months. Um, today, as I said, it was, you know, we had to roll the sleeves up a little bit. I thought we started okay, but then um, Breaking started to take a wee bit of uh, control in the midfield because. We had a free V2 in there. Um, but after about 25 minutes, 30 minutes, I thought we started to started to move the ball quicker. I thought um, Gil Putney and Stuart Carswell were terrific on the other pitch and we started to get Bobby and Dom and, and Gal and that on the ball. And then once we'd done that, I felt we were more, much more in the game. And even in the second half, uh, if we had a wee bit more calmness, we could have, could have made it a bit more relaxing for ourselves. And, but nevertheless, we still relied on Grant to make a perfect save. To, to keep the lead, so overall, everybody made a real positive contribution today. And in a tough match, and in a kind of nervy time at this stage of the season, then the delight for the twins. Right, thanks so much. Thank you. Much.